morning guys I went to work out today I went to the supermarket and I picked up some celery and carrots and I'm here cleaning them so I cleaned the celery I washed them I cut the ends to it and I took off um, these little leaves um, and I'm putting them in Ziploc bags some carrots and I rinsed them I took them out of their packages and I put them straight into the Ziploc so it could just be easier for me to just eat Put these all in the Ziploc. And that's it. I have two bags cut, clean, washed of celery and then my carrot bag. So it makes the job a whole lot easier. But the most part, the celery and the carrots and everything that comes in bag and has dirt on it make sure to wash them really well and then just put them in the block so it could just be ready to go hey guys what's up so today is friday i just finished up blow drying my hair super straight but i did make a video on how to make my hair super curly what are the products that i use and so if you're interested go check that video out as for me friday today we're going out for dinner for my husband's birthday and tomorrow I'll be going to AC to watch Mariah Carey, so I'm excited about that. I will bring you guys along with me. It's a Monday. I'm just sitting here in my car. I'm waiting for to my cake boxing class. I'm still a little shy when it comes to like vlogging out. Like people are like passing by and they're just like staring at you. That's like a little bit like, but I guess I have to get over that, right? I can't wait to get my camera. Then they'll be really staring at it because it'll be like a bulky camera instead of my phone. If it's a camera, then it's like, okay, you're actually doing something with it. Not a, you know, taking a selfie or something. Which is kind of embarrassing, but much. But I did go to Safara and I got a few things in Safara. So I'm gonna film a haul. There's a guy backing up, and last time I was sitting here in my car, and the guy was backing up, and of course he hit my car. Like he slammed into it. I feel like he wanted to hit the brake, but instead of he hit the gas, and he slammed into me to the car. So now every time somebody's like parking in front of me and backing up, I'm like, God, not too close. That yesterday I posted this angle yesterday i posted the spanish version of get ready with me i don't know how many of you guys speak spanish but i think you guys could turn on like the uh, caption or do i have to do that i don't know yeah so go check it out i'm gonna i'm gonna link it here at the end of this vlog or down below i liked it oh god all right <laughs> It's so weird when people look at you filming. It's like, what is that girl doing? Taking selfies? No, I'm not taking selfies all the time. Hey guys, so I just came out of my workout. I'm so tired, look at my hair. And um, the lighting, it's horrible. And I, I just got a coffee with almond milk. And I'm gonna go home, shower, get ready, and maybe I'll film that um, Safari haul for you guys. Yay! Let's start the day. Let's be productive. It's horrible. This lighting is horrible. Hey guys, so I know that I was gonna do a Safari haul. I'm just gonna include it in this vlog. What's a Safari during the weekend? What? 
$200, over $200 worth of stuff. And it's not even a lot of stuff. It's just, I got a refill of this foundation that I always use. I like it. Too Faced Peach Perfect. It's good on my skin. It's I never receive breakouts from it. And um, I like it. So I got a refill on that. The first time I'm going to try the All Nighter by Urban Decay. Oh, it's double capped. It has two caps. I guess that's a good thing to protect it. And um, it's supposed to make your makeup last. Oh, that feels nice. So I got two products for the eyebrows, which I was been wanting to try is the benefit goof proof brow pencil and the gimme brow it's like a volumizing microfiber mascara I'm hearing good things about it and it's a pencil tip here um, and then on the other side comes with the, uh, the little brush for the eyebrows which is good all-in-one I thought it was a brow gel like a setting brow gel but it's not i guess it has like microfibers in it it says brow volumizing fiber gel it's very tiny cute um, oh this is super tiny i'm gonna give this a try i like the packaging I mean, the little that it comes with. It matches the pencil. So I got that for my eyebrows. I also got a a cream lip stain from Sephora's by the Sephora brand. And this is in color 67. It's like a rosy, like a rosy color. So it looks like this. I like the color. It's cute. I need like a creamy creamy pinkish color and I really 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 like and I'm, what I was really going to so far for was the Josie Moran whipped argan oil for the face now this is like for oil it's not an oil it's more like a cream but it leaves your skin looking and feeling so refreshed i mean that's a good creamy let me show you in my hand on my hand you put this on your face before your makeup and sometimes you don't even have to wear makeup because your face looks so dewy and so soft and so radiant you don't you can't really see but it's just great i liked it another one that i really 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 like I'm really liking these products of Ole Henriksen. Um, their products are also skincare, um, not makeup. And this is the vitamin C cream, which also leaves your skin very dewy. If you have more of an oily skin, maybe this is not for you, but my skin has been dry for s I'm just gonna rip this box off. This is in here so this is a travel kit which comes with two mini jars one is the um sea rush brightening gel cream and the other one is the banana bright eye cream brighten your skin meaning that if you have dark spots sun damage what i do because i like to bake in the sun in the summertime so i have some spots in my face and this would just clear it off but not only that but it hydrates your skin it makes it look dewy and it makes it look youthful. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but <sighs> these are bomb. I mean, I love these. And that's it, guys. That's all I got from Sephora. And it was like $200 worth of stuff. Sephora is like insane. I also went to TJ Maxx. And I like going to TJ Maxx. Sometimes you have like good finds. $2.99. And this brings five pairs of under eye. Patches. You cannot go wrong for three dollars, two ninety nine. You can't. So I like going there and grabbing, stocking up with these.
stacking up with a mask. I also got these, um, the gold ones, which I already tried one of them. I really liked it, so I put it on Saturday morning. And it come like this. And it brings... One, two, three, four, five. Five pairs of masks for $2.99. So... You go to Safari, one of these is like $30. $2.99, five pairs, and they work. So it's not like it's a cheap version. They work. Once you put it, they hydrate and they um, take away your bags. They hydrate and they take away your bags. And that's about it, guys. I included this with the vlog, so I don't know if I'm going to continue the vlog. <laughs> Hey guys, so today I went to take Lola for the groomers uh, because she was so stinky and disgusting. I'll put a picture up right here. She was so messy and ugh. so I took her to the groomers and um, I'll be picking her up soon. Look how cute. I'm going to film her once I pick her up so you guys can see.